Igloo, you up for it? When I saw this bit of tech, I had to stop and pause for a second. A high-tech game for dogs? That idea seems a bit far-fetched. But it's perfect for your pup. Good boy. Eric, what did you guys create here? This is Pup Pod. It's an uh, interactive uh, game to keep your dog busy, whether you're at home or you can't be there with them. We figured that dog products were going to be connected to the internet at some point, and we designed a system here that dogs can figure out on their own. Connected dog toys. Love it. I can't wait to learn more about this. It's life-changing having a dog in your family. And there's so many people that, like, like myself, who consider their dogs to be their children. Talk about a man's best friend. Well, there are a lot of smart dogs that just need intellectual stimulation, and they can learn all kinds of things. Pod works like this. Your dog walks up to the toy and motion sensors detect that something is there. A treat will then come out of the dispenser and once the dog makes a connection between the two devices, then the game gets harder. So that their doggy brain is always working. We have a combination of variables that we put together that the dog has to think through. So we use a combination of sounds and these keep getting increasingly harder so that the dog always has a challenge to figure out. They keep getting treats. Doesn't sound so rough to me. This toy may be for dogs, but don't worry. You pet owners play a very important role too. We've got an app here. and You can set parental controls. And so a pet parent could see how much to let their dog eat, and then they can watch on the screen as their dog's playing the game throughout the day. All of this information is streamed over the internet because the hub is connected to someone's home Wi-Fi network. And so we've got this camera here on the front and that uh, will stream video up to the server, and so you can either watch the video in real time, or you can um, watch recorded videos. If you're in a meeting, you can't watch it. But if they are playing and you're watching the video, you can even dispense treats right from the app. So that makes it easy for people to just hone in on the point when their dog had an accomplishment or a breakthrough and watch that piece of the video, or forward it onto social networking so their friends can see it. Dude, that's the coolest. You've gamified pet interaction when you're not even there. Yeah, so it's, it's a game for the human and it's a game for the dog. Sounds to me like everybody wins. The Pup Pod relies heavily on sounds. So can you guess what kind of sound a dog likes best? Most dogs know the sound of a treat bag. And if you've got a dog and you open up a treat bag, they'll come from whatever room in the house when they hear that treat bag open. Cool, so it sounds like you're actually including one of the dog's most heightened senses, and that's their sense of hearing. Well, that's right, and it's a language. They're not human words, but they're sounds that the dog puts together, and it's a language that they're learning. We're trying to get into the side of the mind of the dog and figure out a system and a game that's going to keep the dog engaged as they keep learning new, new things. Lucky dog. Okay, so it looks like Igloo's figured out the pup pot, but I want to see if any dog can pick it up. So we're taking a field trip to doggy daycare. We'll let the doggy games begin. First out of the gate is Bolt. He's figuring out that connection. This is this is level one. I think he's less than a year. That a boy, Bolt. <laughs> Next up, Zion. And well, sometimes you just gotta take care of business first. There we go. Yeah, little relief. There you go. What? But he I got it. Zion, look what you did. All right, we're 2 and 0. Last up, Enzo. Oh. Yeah. Aww. Red, buddy. And some dogs are more camera shy than others. Well, I still think Enzo did an amazing job. It's just, you know, it's a bit of a learn different learning curve for different dogs, right? But here you go, buddy. Good job. But it was so cool seeing the dogs just come in and immediately start interacting with it. I mean, pet owners are going to love this. We're working hard to make sure there's a pup pod in every home. You hear that, Enzo? Pretty soon this is going to be in your home, buddy. Treats all the time!